Alright, so hi guys. Yeah, tripod's a little low. Um, so today I'm kind of, hold on, I'll just hold the camera, I guess. Uh, I'm kind of here with a 100 subscriber special. So as of right now, I think I actually have 98 subscribers. I'll put a picture up. Uh, but like two days ago, I think Saturday, um, I did get up to 103 subscribers and said I would do a 100 subscriber special because of it. And then I lost subscribers. So I'm still going to do it, even though I'm not quite there. I'm only like two subscribers away. So yeah. Um, Huge shout out to Brayden. I'm gonna put up his name right here. Uh, and I'm going to put links to his YouTube channel down in the description, so go check him out. Uh, he really helped me with setting up my Discord server and shouting me out and getting me more subscribers to make this special kind of a thing. Um, and as you notice, the title is in quotes because this was going to be a video anyway and it's not really that special. But yeah, it's the only thing I have. So <laughs> anyway, here we go. So here's the frogs and I ordered a South African bird poop frog, <laughs> a Starry Night Reed frog, hourglass tree frog and tiger leg monkey tree frog so and don't worry i'll show you them and pictures and whatnot oh and if i sound like not super enthusiastic it's because i literally just woke up like my grandmother called me and was like, oh yeah, your frogs are here. And so like, I had to like wake up out of like the deepest and best of sleeps to come and get them. So yeah, if I don't sound super enthusiastic, that's why, but I'm actually like really excited about these guys. I've been wanting them for months and I finally, finally was able to save up enough. So of course, you know, like last frog, my budget's frog, there's care sheets. Obviously I did a ton of research on these guys months in advance before I got them. So pretty much know how to take care of them. <laughs> there we go. So again, with my budget's frog, uh, these are cold. The heating packs are cold, so, uh, yeah. But hopefully, you know, my frog should be fine. You know, my budget's frog was. They're like cocooned in there. <laughs> Okay, so here is the Starry Night Read Frog. Uh, I will open all of these in a minute and try to show you guys. Uh, here is the Bird Poop Frog. I think he's on the bottom, like right there, that brown spot right there. I think that's him. Uh, here is the Hourglass tree frog and finally the tiger leg tree frog oh yep you can see him like right there if it'll focus he's like right there and right now like he's not super colorful so with these guys if they don't look like how they look when they're adults I will put up a picture of them and yep, yeah, so yep. Yeah. Alrighty, I'll come up closer. Oh, 
I might need a sharper knife than this. This is actually like really dull. <laughs> brown if it'll focus hi <laughs> I can see him getting ready to jump see if it'll yep there he is so yep there he is so yep I'll put a picture up over here of him when they're older hi buddy <laughs> come on <laughs> go back in your moss there you go I don't think I'm going to be able to tell any of these guys apart. <laughs> Holy crap. Um, like literally, they're all like the same color. Oh, he's like a chubby little dude. Ugh. 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 Come on. Like, <laughs> look at how chubby he is. If it'll focus on him, like, God, focus. Thank you. See, look at how, like, chubby he is. And you can kind of barely see a little difference in color towards his butt area. Again, if it'll focus on him and not me. See? A little bit of difference in color towards his butt. So yeah, again, I'll put up a picture of their adult form. Nope. Ooh. Come here. Ugh. Tree frogs are so difficult, man. I swear. I know I sound so dead in this video. <laughs> like if anybody watched this video and didn't know I would just woke up, they would be like, dang, you really don't like these frogs, do you? It's like, no, I love these frogs. I've been wanting them for a long time. Oh, he actually looks like his adult form a little bit. Ooh, uh, come here. <laughs> Big scary monster grabbing you. Hi. <laughs> okay. So yeah, it'll focus on him. If I can get a better position, kind of on a weird spot on my arm. He's like right on my wrist, like literally on my wrist. So it's like, yeah. Uh, if I can get this to like focus on him and not me. Hello, focus on him please. On him, thank you. So yeah, hopefully that's a good angle. I kind of had to tilt my camera. Uh, but yep. Do not jump. I can see you getting ready to jump. <laughs> Hi, yep. You, you can jump on this hand, but like not on me. Like, oh, you are on me. Okay. Want to jump up there? <laughs> He's so cute. Like, look how like small these guys are. Come here, bud. I swear to God, tree frogs are so annoying. <laughs> oh, ha, ha. all right. There we go. Got him on my fingers now. Yeah, do not, please. <laughs> So yeah, 
So he actually looks like his adult form, and as you can see, there is the hourglass shape on his back. So that is why, you know, they're called hourglass frogs. Now, like, God, you are like a spastic jumper, dude. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> oh. And then a tiger leg. The final one. And this is one that I'm like super excited about. Because uh, I can already tell you it doesn't look like it's adult form. So here's a picture of it's adult form. These guys look so cool. Like, he is, like, ready to get out. Do you see him up, like, right there, like, trying to get out? <laughs> he is ready. I'm coming, dude. I'm gonna let you go. Oh, his legs are so skinny. Look at him like walk around. Do not jump, <laughs> please. Like, look at him walk. Of course he stops walking right here. Okay, there, yeah, I can force him to walk again. Like, look at him walk, oh my God. He's so cute. Oh, of course it unfocuses on him. So yeah, you can see a little bit along his side, the tiger color stripe things. If I can get it to not focus on me. <laughs> My camera is horrible. There you go. Oh, he's so adorable, and he's like this weird, like, offset, kind of purpley, like, brown color. Oh my god, he's so pretty, too. His legs are so weird, oh my god. Oh, he's like a little puppy. Ah, oh, look at him walk around. Oh! Yeah, Bambi on ice. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I think I just found my new favorite frog. Ah. Anyway, bud, go back in there, please. Ooh, oh, seriously, oh, oh, he is so, like, <laughs> floppy. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, there you go. <laughs> okay, dude. I can't close his thing. He has his head like pushed right up against it. Like right there. So I can't really like close this. But yeah. I'll at least put the lid on it so that he hopefully can't get out. Uh, so I do actually have one more frog. I posted it in my Discord, so if you're here from that night on Discord, you'll recognize this frog. So I've actually had her for a couple of days. Um, I th I've had her for almost a week, I think. Um, <laughs> and this is a glass frog. I'll put pictures of her up. So as you can see, their little bellies are see-through. <laughs> so yeah.
and like, oh, Jesus Christ, she is like a big jumper. Holy crap. <laughs> Ooh. Hi, yep, yep, go back in here now. <laughs> Don't want to lose you. <laughs> okay, um, yeah, do not go out this way. <laughs> okay, <then. laughs> Okay, well, she jumped like right into her water bowl and it's just like hanging out now. Oh wait, that's actually a good view of her underbelly. So yeah, as you can see, you can see through it. So yeah. And of course these guys will get to be, um, if they're males, about one and a half inches. And if they're females, two inches, maybe a little more, but not a lot. Uh, I would get out my bigger tree frog, but like I don't want to disturb him. He's like that big So almost the size of uh, like kind of Half my finger. So as you saw those guys could fit on the tip of my finger So yeah So anyway, uh, I would show you them their cage, but my grandmother has <laughs> a company over and their cage is like in the kitchen because we decided to put them kind of on display and not in the back room, like here with all my other animals like that. So, so yeah, I can't show you their cage, but, uh, and yes, I am cohabbing them and it's because they are all similar in size and they all have all like, pretty much the exact same care because if I'm not mistaken I think most of them come from the same area like kind of the tropical area like um, South America, Costa Rica, stuff like that so pretty much like same area so yes they are able to be housed together and I will keep an eye on them and if one of them ever starts growing faster than the others I will immediately take it out and put it in its own separate cage and that's why I'm not putting them with my bigger frog because if they are different in size and you know a noticeable size difference they will eat each other so <laughs> I will be keeping an eye on these guys like a really close eye on them and I'm practically nocturnal that's why I just woke up and it's like two in the afternoon because I stay up all night uh, so I will be keeping a very close eye on these guys, so. Uh, so yeah, anyway, uh, I hope all of you have a great day. I hope you enjoyed seeing my frogs, uh, this kind of special. Uh, so yeah, I'll see you some other time. I'll probably stream playing Call of Duty in a couple days or something. Uh, well, bye. <laughs>